about billions promotion. You know what I'm saying? I'm just calling a spade a spade. Where you at? Man, you've always had some of your best work in your fight when you get on the inside, the combos to the head and the body, that's what happened late against Mikey. Is that the, are you gonna have to go right to Jesse and get on the inside to win this fight? Just watch the fight, man. Just watch the fight. Adrian. You've accomplished a lot at a young age in the sport. You have a four-time champion. What's it like working with another young talent? Javante Tank Davis. Um, I've, been, I've, been, I've, been, I've been working with Javante, man. Me and, me and Tank, we've been working together, man. You know, I, I, had him, I had him with me since he was a baby, man. So it's not the first time we've been in the gym together. Now, you did the 25A series, which yeah. was lit on YouTube. Yeah. What, what made you come up with that idea? And, and why are you such a good self-promoter? Um, because I understand business. You know, uh, just being a good boxer won't get you to a, to, a, to a star level. You know, you have to be an entertainer. I understand that. And you know, uh, if I don't promote myself, they won't until the week of the fight. And then, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just saying, every, like, like, like if, if I didn't do it, the content would never have been put out. See what I'm saying? So, so I understand I got to do that myself to, to, to let the fans see me more and just to be seen. Hey Lee, you said that uh, this was, I think, a fake-ass press conference. Yeah. Is it because there's all the NYPD and the rapper beef or can you specify man, a little man. more? I'm all right. I pulled up. Where's 6 9 at? I'm here. Hey, hey, I ain't worried about nothing. So what was fake-ass about? Uh, it's cuz, man. It's garbage. Adrian, in those fights where it didn't go your way, was it? Were you one hundred percent for the Mikey Garcia fight? And then Damn, we here to talk about some negative shit. Well, I just, well, I just want to know what would be the to, like. Was we ain't camp, about was camp negative. better for this camp than it was for that fight? Was this a better camp? Um, I'd like to talk after the results. You know what I'm saying? I just like talking after the results, and um, I, I like you know I've done a lot of talking in, in, in my career and. And it's time to show with actions, you know. Um, like, like, like we're talking. I ain't got no bad blood with man with the promotions, but right now we just on two different different sides of the playing field. I'll talk to y'all afterwards. Ain't, I ain't got no beef with Floyd or Leonard, but at the end of the day, it's the truth. They on that side. That's what it is. Ab, what's the difference between what's, what's the notice? What did you, what did you notice? The biggest difference between the training with Mike Stafford and Kevin Connors? What was the biggest uh, difference? To you? It was a hell of a difference, man. It's a hell of a difference. But you know, um, I ain't here to talk about uh, my dad and my. It's like my dad and my stepdad. I'm not here to talk about the difference between them. One had me, and one just taking care of me right now. I don't know. Hey, 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 I know that you always have a lit rapper taking you out. Who's gonna bring you out this time? You know how to rap? No, I'm not a rapper, but you feel me? Write a rap. I'll let you bring that. <laughs> AB. There's, a, there's, a rumor, there's a rumor that Takeshi is going to come out. You can say yes or no to that. Next question. What would you take away from, from your last loss? Not that you would call those blessings into We still talk about neg negativity? Uh, aren't you applying to your training over the past year huh? for this fight? And no negativity. And now you move through different weight classes and place your weight. How do you feel at one point? I feel great, man. I feel great. Man. I feel strong. I feel great. And um, you guys are going to see a hell of an Adrian Broner Saturday night. Adrian, is it, is it going to be a war, like a great fight, or are you going to make it not I don't give a fuck. We can go to war. We can buy. We can do it all. I'm ready for whatever he bring to the table, I promise you. How was sparring for this fight? Oh, great. AB, hey, I noticed in 25A, I, I even said it in one of my videos, that I saw joy for the first time in about two years in Adrian Broner's face. Can you speak on that? Uh, you know, um, it's just it's just getting back to loving boxing again. That's all. Is 
it, is it hard to, to stay in love with boxing? It's so hard to do. It's a tough sport to stay it's in. It's a lonely sport, man. It's a lonely sport. You Does it you hope that they give you credit in this fight? I just hope they give me credit. So you feel you haven't gotten credit for past accomplishments? You know, uh, they always try to downplay it. You know, it's just like, I don't want to, I don't really want to make comparisons of me and Floyd, but it's just like when Floyd beat somebody they downplay it. You know, he should have beat him up. It's, it's always an excuse. We never get our real, you know, due diligence. You know, but you let Canelo go beat somebody and he's the greatest in the world. Or Lomachico go beat somebody and he's the best in the world, pound for pound. On. But, you know, it is what it is. I just I just know what's going on. Does Broner, it? what's the positivity that you want to talk on? You want to be no negatives. What's the positive stuff that you do want to talk about and want us to ask you about? How my kids and my family are doing. How are they doing? Uh, they doing great. Okay, all right. That was, that was my jeweler. Um, but, um, <laughs> yeah, but they're, they're doing, they're doing, they're doing great, actually. And you know, um, I'm just happy to wake up and all of my children to know that I'm dad and that I'm gonna provide for them and keep them smiles on their faces. And uh, I'm gonna work hard for them. Ab, does it bother you? on some level that you believe in inherently that Big Bro is on the other side so he's not rooting oh, for Oh no, nah, it's business. Okay. It's business. I'm just, I just got the balls to say it. 